Uh, let's talk with our guests. We have uh, Mark Skippy Price here, and uh, you, again, the name is from your days on Family Ties. Yes, and this, I've grown to cope. It's it's my moniker. Yeah. It's my stripper name. Uh, there you go. Yeah. I, I like to go camping in the backwoods, like seriously far deep. And so there's bears. And they tell you, if you see a bear, make yourself appear bigger mm. than you are. Yeah. So I say, I just did the Tonight Show and I got a three-picture deal with Disney. <laughs> 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 the bear nods and walks away. Runs away. Runs. Oh, oh, this guy's got something. He's too big for us to mess with. You guys go ahead. Now, you're sort of considered to be a, a, a child star, and but you're doing okay because you read so, so much. Of this, so it's always so sad. Not always, but so often so sad. You look great. I went to a party. All of the ex-80s child stars were there. And oh. it wasn't a party. It was a seance. Uh, <laughs> oh. 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 Many wow. of them are, are not with us. That was not planned, and I'm sorry I brought that up. But, yeah. Yeah, but I mean, yeah, that's... Yeah. But I grew up in the 80s in Hollywood and showbiz, and Michael Jackson never touched me. Yeah. There you go. You win. Do you feel a little left I'm out? insulted. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Aren't I as cute as little Webster? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag, why not me too? Oh, there you go. That is very funny. And Mark Skippy Price, who is a delightful guy. It's, I'm so glad you're doing so well. Just a fun guy. We're having a nice chat off the air. He is... Uh, you really sound surprised. Well, no, awesome, I mean, we man. were joking about it before, but so many people who start a career in Hollywood is at a young age end up a mess. Well, and uh, I'm, he's probably a mess behind the scenes, but he's <laughs> on a surface hey, level. You're extraordinarily presenting. funny and nice. How, what was your age uh, on Family Ties? When 14 you... to 21. Okay. Oh, wow. So wow. I was a little bit older than like a child star. I was like six or seven. You right. Know, so I feel right. that helped. And then my dad was a comedian, and I think comedy oh, really? has saved my life. Your dad I mean, was a radio guy. Where would I be right now without stand-up comedy, honestly? <laughs> Tell me about your dad. I'd be uh, one of the different Strokes kids, for sure. Uh, they went from shooting a series to a series of shootings. But, oh. <laughs> but my, my dad was um, on the radio in 1940. He became famous with Fred Allen when wow. people would watch the radio. Huh, which yeah. is what they do now with you guys, but they watch it on the internet. Yeah, right. <laughs> they used to actually just watch the radio, right? And so, uh, he, you know, in those days, that was it. That was If you were on the Fred Allen show, everybody in the country knew who you were. And so that uh, started them off pretty good. Huh. Now, uh, you, you mentioned uh, off the air, maybe. You've never been married, never had kids, is that correct? That is correct. I do um, have a girlfriend for eight years, so I'm, I'm starting to gray. Oh, oh the, gray is, <laughs> the gray is coming in now. Is she, is oh, she yeah. also oh, a yeah. uh, show business person of any kind? She's a, um, you could say she's a movie star. She's in one of the biggest movies ever made, but... I'm not allowed to say who she is. She made me sign a non-disclosure agreement. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like Fisher Stevens when he was dating... Uh, Michelle Pfeiffer? Yeah, it's kind of like that. Well, like, oh, she's not yeah. as famous as Michelle Pfeiffer, but she doesn't want anyone to know she's with me. <laughs> well, I want to guess now. <laughs> Boy, that Fisher Stevens is a wild-looking guy, huh? Is he on yeah. su Succession? He's got that giant head. Oh, wow. is he? Yeah. <laughs> I'll oh. just tell you, actresses and models are the worst. <laughs> because the only time they think of anybody else is when they're having sex with me. <laughs> <laughs> that's nice. very, very good. Did you Mark follow Price. that a long time? Uh, I Were you that's, there? That's All hilarious. Right. That's, okay. that's brilliant. Uh, Mark, Mark Price on tour. Brilliant. We'll give you some of those dates coming up. Pat, do you have a song about our guest? Ready to go. Mark with a C, Mark Price, P-R-I-C-E, <laughs> but he was on Family Ties, so he'll always be skipping to you and me. <laughs> All right. I like it. I like it, man. Very nice. That's my new theme song. <laughs> then you can then the chorus can be, who is the girl that he's dating? <laughs> Mallory. <laughs> Mallory Bertinelli. Uh, wow, yeah, this is a uh, interesting uh, chapter about Valerie Bertinelli and Matthew Perry's book. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, and uh, Eddie, uh, Edward, I'm sorry. Edward, Edward Van Halen. Van Halen. Yeah, yeah, that was All right. A, he was, my first job was on One Day at a Time. Oh. And there was Valerie Bertinelli, my crush forever, you know. Yeah. And, uh, and she, I remember she was talking to some of her people there and I, I was just listening and she said yeah the new album it's totally not like you'd expect it's like a they're a barbershop quartet <laughs> I don't know what album she was referring to <laughs> yeah I wonder what it was oh I know what it was the early 80s oh, no it was probably Bombadita bum it was Happy oh, Trails yeah. oh. they did that they did that as a acapella thing which I th always thought was hilarious oh. yeah and it had to be great for uh, Dale Evans to get that check <laughs> I bet oh, who, well, who would have ever yeah. guessed yeah here's yeah. four guys you would never talk to Here's a million dollars. Because <laughs> wow. mm -hmm. she wrote that, right? 
Dale Not Evans. Uh, uh, I thought the horse wrote it. I don't know. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> well, <laughs> you, they, he could say Happy it. Happy yeah. That's a great song. <laughs> There's a, a place where they did that, right? You know the famous place where they're riding and singing on the horse? On the horses? Am I wrong about this? The, they sing the song. And there's, it's the beginning yeah. mm. of the show or something, the end of the show. Mm. And that's in um, Pines, Big big Pines, something in California. It's off the 395. They shot all the westerns in oh, this neat. area there. Huh. And it's uh, they, the actual road is still there. It's so funny. And didn't they shoot MASH? That's so, in the Santa Monica Mountains. Yeah, yeah I go hiking. Fairly really close to LA. MASH. No, that's the Spawn Movie Ranch over there where they... Uh, oh, where they, they killed all the people? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah that's okay. right. Yeah. Thanks, yeah. Thanks. Yeah. You ask anybody what North Korea looks like, they think it looks like the Santa Monica Mountains. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Now, uh, the actor strike, by the way, over. It's done. Done. Yeah, settled it. Boom. Uh, I can promote all my movies. 12 hey! <laughs> I actually am in a new movie. Oh, oh you are? are? First one. First one in decades. Uh, what are you in? It's called Witchy Ways, and it comes out in 2024. It's a horror movie, and I play the antagonist. I'm not the monster, but it's different for me because I've never been the bad guy. Excellent. Ooh, that's, the voice of, uh, Mark, that's the voice of Mark Skippy Price. Sorry. Trying to wedge a plug in there. Okay. Um, By the way, I've been promoting this movie all through the strike. I didn't. <laughs> I, didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't oh. I never stopped. Oh. But there's a law I think you're not supposed to do that. Scab. I feel like a scab. 